Am I the asshole for calling my mom pathetic, stupid, and a terrible person? This posted by throw 4 away for y 135 My older sister's husband passed away years ago. They have two sons, 12 and 11. Edit should probably specify that her husband passed away when the boys were 6 and 7. My sister is single by choice and has stated that she has zero plans on dating or marrying anyone. She says she only loves and trusts one man and that her love life isn't worth the risk of her kids getting hurt. Well, our mom has been consistently trying to get her married to Mike. He's a lot older though, while his daughter is a lot younger. Also, he and my sister do not get along, especially since my sister is more relaxed in terms of parenting while he's more strict. He's also made comments on how if they were to get married, he would never see her sons as his own. He has called them competition before, but he fully expects her to raise his child. It's ridiculous. Another fun coincidence is that my oldest nephew and Mike share the same birthday. Now that her boys are older, she lets them hang out with their friends, and then when they come home, she organizes a little celebration. She loves birthdays, so she goes all out. My sister and I were decorating the house for the birthday when we got a text from mom saying, come quick, it's urgent. We panicked and started calling, but she wasn't answering, so we quickly drove over and were greeted by tons of cars parked outside the house and lots of noise and music. Turns out our mom threw a party for Mike and tricked my sister into coming. Our mom didn't even say hi and just went, I have some potty clothes in my room. My sister was in so much disbelief and started to cry, but our mom was still trying to usher her into the house. She just ran back to the car. My mom looked at me and went, Can you go talk to her? Mike's going to be so happy to see her. I don't think y'all understand how shocked I was. My mom just would not accept that my sister does not want Mike in any way. I ended up calling my mom pathetic, stupid, and a terrible person. My mom started to cry and started to ask me what my problem was. She said that she's my mother and I need to have some fucking respect. Besides, this isn't even about you. I just rolled my eyes and walked off, but my dad heard and started yelling at me saying I'd better apologize or else. My parents don't even get along, and our other sibling said that our mom's getting a lot of support, so now I'm wondering if I was the asshole for what I said. Am I the asshole? Top comment here from Eastern Amphibian385, NTA. Ooh, WTF is wrong with your mom. This guy sounds horrible for your sister. Response to that by Tosser9212, this guy sounds horrible for anyone. NOP responding here says he is. He also got into a really bad argument with her eldest son a couple of months ago and called him terrible things. Just a weird and strange man overall. And from Crystals2000, OP, I think you need to tell your mom that if she loves Mike so much, she should marry him. But no one else is going to. Your poor sister. Right. Why can't mom take the hint here? Number one, she stated that she doesn't want to be set up with anyone. She's not interested in a relationship. And holy shit, mom, there's someone out there who doesn't need someone else to be happy. Isn't that just a crazy thought? <sighs> Also, when people learn to be happy with themselves and just accept the fact that they're going to be by themselves with their kids forever and they're perfectly happy with that, that mindset can lead to a relationship because it can connect you with someone who is also happy and with their kids and not needing someone for the rest of their lives. So being happy, being independent is not a bad thing, mom. Back the f*** off. You don't have to try to set your daughter up with someone, period. Why you would try to set your daughter up with someone who is clearly just a douche noodle is beyond me. Why? 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 Mom's like, hi, it's me. I'm the problem. It's me. And to trick her into coming over, back up. To throw a party for this dick, then to trick her own daughter into coming to the party for this dick, when she already has her own party stuff going on for her son, is just like the biggest pile of bullshit I've ever seen in my entire life. Mom is way out of line. Mom's priority. Priorities are f That was a long censor bleep, huh? Mom sees something in Mike that no one else sees. And some of those comments about her marrying him, I completely agree with. If she likes him that much, go for it. That would suck for OP and OP's sister here because then they'd have to deal with him even more. But Mike needs to pound sand. He needs to get the hell out of there. He seems like a terrible person. And mom trying to push a terrible person on her daughter and tricking her into shit and not respecting her wishes makes mom an ass con one. Yeah, mom is an ass con one. I don't know how close you guys are with her otherwise, but she's inflicting a lot of damage on you right now. And I'd say distance reduces damage. No contact is an option here. She's inflicting some pain though and that needs to stop one way or another. Either by her wising up or by you guys just backing off from her. Which sucks but I'm making an assumption here that OP's sister has thoroughly explained everything to mom that she does not like this guy. She does not want to be around him at all. She is not going to end up with him in any kind of relationship and that she needs to stop trying to push him on her. I'm assuming that has all been thoroughly explained and it sounds like it has and if that is the case then yeah mom a shit mom. Quit trying to ruin your daughter's life. 
None of this is okay. OP, you're not an asshole for speaking up on your sister's behalf at all. Bravo to you for standing up for her. Someone has to slap mom in the face with some words here and get her to realize how drastically wrong she is. You are not an asshole at all. Mom, ask on one. Dad is probably just acting in solidarity of mom here and defending her once you berated her, but it was warranted, and he probably knows that. It'd be cool if he stood up and advocated for his daughter here, but what are you going to do, you know? Either she wises up or she doesn't get to be in your guys' life. There was a quote I saw recently that said, when you get the right people at the table, the meals get a lot more calm. And this may be one of those situations where your mom might need to be escorted from the table of your lives, and then your lives will get much more calm. If she can't figure out how to stop doing damage, that's what's going to happen.